All right. Red Meadows Arena, December the 10th, PBC. This contest between Mark Joyce from Durham and Cameron Duggan, all the way from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, USA. Should be an interesting fight. Three rounds, two minutes around. Our referee, Kevin Weaver, will get us underway. Second round, round one. Uh, and here we go. Fast start from, Ke uh, from Cameron there. Looking to work the body of Mark. Very aggressive, fast. Mark's having to soak up some punches very early on. And whether that... And Cameron swinging. Really, how many are connecting? He's going for it. Fast start again. If you've watched any of our other PBC bouts from this event, December the 10th on our YouTube channel, you see there's been some fantastic contests throughout the evening. Absolutely fantastic. This one again, high intensity, high urgency. So Cameron there in the gold and black, Mark in the silver, silvery white short. Up there, Mark's bleeding from his forehead, and that's from a clash of heads, and from a punch. Time, time. Just going to get him checked out. This is semi-pro. Um, we want to make sure he's okay. We have fantastic paramedics the ringside, and just going to make sure Mark's all right. Check the cut, make sure he's okay to carry on. Make sure it's not too serious. Make sure that the health and safety and the welfare of our fighters is our number one priority. Take care of that one. That looks like a clash ahead one, that, I think. So, our paramedics will check him out. A little bit of, bit of Vaseline on it. Just take care of that. Keep an eye on it. We've got 32 seconds left in the round. Let's see how it goes. I'm sure Mark does not want to stop and we're back underway box and yeah looking at that one must have been a clash of heads but again Cameron coming in very aggressive and Mark's got the re Mark's got the height advantage and he's been pulled down to Cameron's level and stepping up now they're absolutely whirling absolutely going for it 10 seconds last 10 seconds of the round in the corner a bit of time to work on that cut This has been non-stop. There's the end of round one. That's a tricky one to call, really, I suppose. Um, cuts might cause Mark some problems, but doesn't seem to be halting his progress. Round two. All right, let's go round two. Mark Joyce, Cameron Duggan, Cameron in the gold and black shorts. Mark in the silver white. Frenetic first round. After suffering a cut, but it was from the clash of heads. But pressing on. Oh, just walked onto a left hand there, Mark from from Cameron. Again, looking to return with his own. Uh, that was a nice left from Cameron again. Mark's still coming forward, still pressing. This right hand. Made its way through. Right, Mark going. Oh. It's called time there while the mouth guard comes out from Cameron. Is it Cameron's mouth guard or, or Mark's there? I think it might have been Mark's actually. Make sure we're all right. Get it back in. Let's check that cut as well. A minute left in the round. Round number two, we're just halfway through the contest. Alright, and we're back underway. 
Box. With a minute left. Box. Well, Mark's still eager to get on. It's halted a bit of a bit of momentum he had there. That mouthpiece is causing trouble again. And a bite down. And he took a good shot there from Cameron. Oh, still pressing forward. Tough guy. Both really tough guys. Taking shots and stepping into them. Cracking contest. And the last 30 seconds of the round. Starting to breathe a little bit heavy. I don't know if he's, he's just starting to gas. Last ten of the round. Cameron will be looking for the ball to come. He's lost a lot of energy. See, it's a couple of the shots that took it out of him. Not just the intensity of the contest, but he is very much breathing a lot heavier now. Seconds out. Alright, referee Kevin Weger brings them together as we go into round three. Round three. Here we go for our third and final round of the contest. Cameron Duggan all the way from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, coming all the way to Durham to take on Mark Joyce in the Silver Trunks. Even contest so far. And Cameron probably took the first one, Mark the second, but Cameron just starting to flag a little bit but he's come out swinging he's come out but we do know this punches that connect really do sap that energy if Mark can find a home for some of them he's trying to work that body there body shots sometimes they don't look that that bad they don't look that destructive but they really do hurt absolutely sap your energy with the uppercut there Cameron and ducking in walking onto that uppercut Mark's definitely looking the fresher of the two Cameron breathing heavier still got some power he's still dangerous last minute of the fight Mark popping that left jab out this fight for me swung into Mark's favour still a little bit of time left Cameron's really going to have to dig deep. He's going to have to bite down on that gum shield and really go for it. Because I think this is Mark's fight to lose now. He's the more active. He's swinging more. You can see that Cameron's really tired. That second round did for him. And that jab, scoring points. Scoring shots there. Cameron's dug deep. He's, got He's still coming back. Mark keeping him again. Another shot to the body. Out comes the mouthpiece again. Time. So, last 15 seconds of the round, last 15 seconds of the fight. Ten seconds. Another enthralling contest at the PBC here at Rent Meadows Arena. It's going to go to the scorecards. Oh, fantastic contest. Well done, guys. B great fight. Let's uh, go to. Uh, Kevin and see who's took the win. Just making sure that cup and marks taken care of. While we're doing that, once again, show your appreciation, show some love for your fighters! Close contest, fantastic contest. Our referee, Kevin Reed, was coming to me and said that was his fight of the night. So, boys, well done. Absolutely well done. Great contest. But we do have a winner, and he's fighting. And the red corner, Mark Jones! It's going to make some noise for Cameron, the anxiety attack. Duggan! Just to see the shade of the foundation, just to see the shade of the team.